time you're seeing me welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new hi hey what's up and how is your day going how is your day going forget the mess in today's video is, is something a little bit different but not too different because i've done a video like this before but today's video will be a little bit you know more what's the word i don't know the word it's going to be something better if you know what i mean so today i'm going to go out thrifting oh Anyone that knows me personally knows I love thrifting. I mean, in Nigeria, of course, <laughs> most of the things I got, most of the things I had were thrifted. So, thrifting in this country, for my, this which basically my first time thrifting here, is gonna be great. And I've already been thrifting for the past two days, like during my school breaks. So I'll just hop onto the thrift store and see what I can see and see what I can get. So you guys already know you're gonna get a lovely, beautiful, and intensive haul after my after this segment hopefully i section this video so this video can be more in, important interesting i know the word so, so what we're wearing I'm wearing this white shirt thingy that has some stars and some sweatpants i don't know why i can't check on these easy slides i don't know or jeeps i don't know if you guys watched my last video and i was like i told you guys after washing my hair that i was going to make my hair now I made this hair myself. If you, if you basically follow my Instagram and my TikTok, you already know I made this hair like three days, five days ago. So yeah, this hair took me three days to do. If, you, if you're wondering, <laughs> basically my first time making it myself. I should have done a TikTok video for that whole thing. Like because I was thinking, oh well, it's my first time, so I don't want to mess up what I'm doing recording. Because almost everyone told me I should have. Even before I even made the hair, my mom was like, why don't you record yourself? And I was like, I can't because I'm yeah. Anyways, I'm just heating up some pasta. After that, I'm just going to hop onto the thrift store. I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I'm really, really excited because it's like a I don't call it fall outfits because I also got some summer outfits. <laughs> it's stupid, but like I got so many like pieces that I really love to add to my wardrobe. Let's go. <laughs> Hey boys and girls, so we went to the thrift store, I found this jacket but wasn't really my style. Then I found this brown jacket, I loved it but then it was £18, excuse me. I like this but no. There weren't really like much ladies top so that was quite frustrating to be very honest. And me casually looking at the men's section because that's what I always do. They had some things but some of the things weren't really like my style or my size. Caught some things, tried this was so tiny and it was a size 8 a size 8 for a toddler i don't get i don't get it this oh i can't wait to talk about this for the longest time just get ready for the try on haul okay this was mwah. my plan was to look for more black stuff and this just wasn't giving i still tried on the brown jacket but it was just not giving i didn't like it at all i didn't like how it fitted on my body it was just meh nope I would have gotten this but the I don't know the hands were too small if they were like longer or something then I would have given that I would have given this you know a chance I went to another store and some of the things just weren't my style I didn't like anything here at all I got some things but I just dropped them back I went to another one I would have gotten this to be honest I would have gotten it but I just didn't like that Thing on my knees i just didn't like how it felt and it felt tight so i just dropped it because nah felt weird found these black jeans but they were too big on my waist so i just dropped them back couldn't just think of buying such a thing that didn't really fit me i found this black tank top it was like a knit kind of thing i would have gotten this but it was too big i was so frustrated i'm like why couldn't this be a smaller size but yeah, just didn't fit me, so I have to drop it back. Then I found this Laura Ashley brown jacket. Y'all just stay tuned for the haul because I have a whole story on how I cop this. 
I went in for the next day because there was nothing I could find that Saturday. So Sunday, I found this brown thing. It was a size four, but it was so pretty, God. Still went looking around, I didn't see anything. So another day, I still no slay. I went in on Monday and this was a size nine and it didn't fit me. I was so infuriated. I was so angry, like, oh my God. I like them, but they're too big. I don't know why they don't have size eight. Why? Why? These are size nines anyways. So I found these black cargo thing. I don't know what material they were. Sorry, I don't know things. I don't know clothes, material things. Anyways, I like this, but I don't know. It wasn't just giving. I was thinking of an outfit idea in my head and nothing was really like coming up. So I dropped it because I'm regretting it now, but then it's not that serious, if you know what I mean. Then I found these yoga pants, I guess. I don't really know what to call them, but like they were just mwah, had to get them. They were like two pounds and ninety-nine cents. I know this is this is a really like bad view and you can see the bottle, my water bottle literally behind me. Anyways, um they're like these flare yoga pants and I was yeah, I was living for them right now. I had to buy them. I only got my own matching socks. Anyways, yeah, back to this vlog. <laughs> Hello guys, hello. So it's been a rocky three days, three days, three days. Don't mind the wet thingy on my shirt, it's water. I began this video on Saturday. A lot of things happened. A lot of things happened, but it's my last day thrifting for this video. Highlighting the most important part of that sentence for this video because thrifting is my baby. I feel like gotten almost everything that I, most of them, most of the items I didn't really get. I don't know why I'm doing this in my hair, but like most of the things I've gotten, I didn't like put them on camera because again, sometimes vlogging could be hard like in public. Yeah, I almost have a practice today, and I have to go in the next 20 30 minutes. Bye, see you later. Hello. I'm on my way back home, so people are watching me hop to the phone. So I'll see you when I do my home. Hello, governor. Hello. Bonjour. Hola. And hola. How are you guys doing? Last time you saw me was when I said see you in my home. That was three days ago, four days ago, I can't remember. Let me give you guys like a background story. This video has been filmed for almost a week. Okay, last week, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, that's when I did like in shop. That's when I was doing like thrifting, doing classes. Then Saturday, Sunday, when I actually had the time to do thrifting, I didn't find the best things on those weekends which was mind-blowing because it was only during the week that i could find quality finds but i still got quality finds at the end of the day so stay tuned for that girls and boys i didn't like find most of the things that i really wanted to add to this thrift video so i went on to like check on other thrift apps like depop um vinted finds just anything that could be great and I got some of these here. Most of them basically were from thrift stores, but some of them were from Vinted. Vinted, yeah. If you don't know the app, got us put the app. Yeah. So let's begin. So we'll begin with bottoms. Bikini bottom. Okay. Yeah, it's this. I don't know how to explain this material. Yeah, I'm not good with material, so I should have been good in home economics before. Anyways, it's from the brand Nitya with a size, size UK 10. It's crazy because I'm a size 8, but like for bottoms, I could only, the only things that could fit me were size 10 and 12. Anything size 8 couldn't pass my leg upwards. If you know what I mean, okay. Yeah, I love this so much. I mean, it gave me summery vibes. It gave me like, okay, I'm going to Europe for the summer. Even though summer has basically passed and this is basically a full inspired ish video. I still got it because it gave me summer vibes, so don't judge me. I styled this with a black 
tank top thingy yeah that is the black tank top thingy and i feel so great i feel so great i felt so happy like i want to express it just gave me it's girl vibes it gave me clean girl vibes if you know what i mean I have this parachute pants and when I first got this right I was shocked I'm like who the hell just dropped this perfect parachute pants just dumped it was not dumped because you don't want it anymore but like you just dumped it in that store anyways this is from boohoo man to confess almost everything I got here I got them from the men's section and this is a very irrelevant topic but like I finally know how to make myself a good cup of coffee so that's great this is again size medium i would get a, a small but no the small wasn't just my thing i like baggy things down so that's my excuse to be fair I, i've been obsessed with parachute pants for the longest time i styled this with the same black tank top because again i mean tight on top here with the Bugging down there. Hopefully that makes sense. Then I got these. Oh my gosh, guys! I didn't like say the prices. The pra. I said the prices. The prices. The. Why does that sound weird? The prices. Great. So the first this I got this for six pounds ninety nine cents. Got this for I think was, this was five pounds. So this was six pounds. <laughs> this is a size ten. This was tight all the way down, but like my waist. It was kind of baggy. I, I think I'll just personally mend that. I'm not just I, I can't sew that like that. But I can mend, if that makes sense. So this is like a it's a tight ish yoga pants, but they're flared. I just love it because it gave me that Emma Chamberlain style. I'll put the picture in spo around somewhere. And it's from ASOS. I'm imagining me actually buying this from ASOS. I'm not a rich girl yet. I'm on the I'm in the process of becoming a big girl. I'm, I'm not there yet. But it's just from ASOS, oh my god. And to be honest, I don't think I will ever stop thrifting. If you want to watch my last thrifting video, it's in my description box below. I can't remember what I styled this with. I just like it. It's dear to me now. This has to be one of the best things I got from this haul. I'm a no... The tight trousers. Skinny jeans. Why did that leave my brain? The only skinny jeans I can really tolerate are the ones that have flare. I'm a flare jeans kind of person. So if it's going to be tight, it's going to be skinny thing. It has to be flare down because I just can't imagine. I don't hate skinny jeans. I just don't think it's for me. Do you know what I mean? I'll call this a low rise. It gave me very much low rise. I've been looking. Come, this bear, can you close your mouth? Looking for low rise jeans for the longest. And for thing, I wasn't looking for low rise in this particular shopping thing. I probably styled this with almost every outfit after for tops and everything else because this has to be one of my quality finds. I'll do anything to get more of these kind of low rise jeans because they're great. They're just wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. have this green skirt if you're new to my channel if you don't know that i'm in love with green i'm in love with green and i wasn't even looking for this it just popped like i was just going around the shop and i found this i was like oh my god this is so pretty my flatmates are making noise oh my god anyways i just found this on the rock i was like hmm this looks pretty let must try it on and it looks so pretty on me like what the hell I was so flabbergasted, like your girl was shocked. I think the coffee is better in my brain. I'm acting so sensitive and so happy sensitive. I don't know what's going on. Okay. This is from Principles. Hello. I very much fall in love. I very much fall in love with it. You know what I mean? 
they look so pretty i just looked at it i was like i have to cop it i had to because um like again this is a fun inspired video but like most of my style is like quite inspired by pinterest so there's that i could literally imagine myself styling this skirt with everything and it's crazy because when i was younger my aunt had like a lot of long skirts like this i'm looking at her like why are you wearing that kind of long skirt it's not fun it's not inspired bro i was seven and what do i know about fashion style it was seven what i used to ugh, i can't even explain my inexplicable fashion sense at that time disgraceful very very disgraceful but back to topic i told my auntie oh what are you wearing you see what you're wearing is set and a style like it's not pretty now i'm the one looking for long skirts the irony of life to be honest the irony of life that's it for bottoms time to check tops uppers what the so we have this green top i got this because again like i said before i didn't find like tops like nice lady tops from most of the thrift shops around here hopefully if i travel to maybe somewhere else that's not this place i would find a nice store that has nice tops for girls because i don't really find anyways back to topic when i got this i was like i didn't like it at first like i didn't really like it at all i'm coming i have to go and talk to my flatness to keep them all short right now i'm back at first when i first tried it on like before this haul i didn't like it but when i tried it again it looked pretty i think i just got it for getting sick it's not something i'll wear this fall if that makes sense i'll wait to like may or something when it's hot from the same seller on vintage i got this corset it looks disastrous right now <laughs> when i first saw it i was like it's that kind of thing where you find when you look at it and you're like what the hell is this so i saw it and i was like i was quite skeptical about it but i tried it on the, that first time like not like the first time i saw it i didn't like it either but i wore it again and i liked it i think i will totally wear this this fall this winter period but probably be with a jacket or like cover up obviously it's going to be a cover up i could wear this for summer next year or for spring last nah, spring is still a little bit cold for summer next year yeah i really like it i started with some jeans i think i can't really remember to be honest i really can't remember then we have this green top why am i struggling with the hands right now i'm literally struggling with the hands right now from new look it's a uk6 i love this i just like how tight and i just like how tight they looked i feel like a downtown girly like gilmore girly when i wore this i plan on like getting a lot of basics i'm gonna do it i think i'm gonna do a video so stay tuned then we have this green sweatshirt oh, it's just pretty i just like how pretty it looks and i like how baggy and how long it could cover my hands just something i could wear with anything right now because it's getting cold in the uk right now The next thing we have oh this has to be one of my favorite tops oh it's inside out my pinterest has been filled with so many knitwear and i'm just i can't wait to get into knitwear knit what am i to knitwear i like knitwear like it's so crazy like so pretty and in the thrift stores they had there were so many like literally so many but some of them i just didn't like some of them because some of them were really my style but like i found this is what i've been looking for for the longest time it's not see-through see-through like i don't know if you can see what where i'm trying to it's not see-through but you can wear just like a, a cami top with this and you'll be 
fine it just gave me really nice cozy vibes i'll show you my inspiration of how this was copped <laughs> yeah i just love how pretty it is and it's so cozy and it's big and it's warm and it's just everything i want so beautiful so beautiful so i have this basic just a really large ish black neck top from log l-o-g-g time for jackets i'm really really excited for this so we have this brown jacket so i was in the thrift store different thrift store that yeah this thrift store was all of these stuff were like from almost seven different thrift stores i really did the job guys this is basically a designer jacket laura ashley you can check up you can leave my not leave my video more like you can pause go to safari go to google just check laura ashley i'll come back in like one minute all for you I don't okay you're back good the main point of this whole video for me was finding a leather jacket that would make me happy initial goal was to find like a black leather jacket but like the ones i was seeing was past my budget so i saw about 39.99 cents and i just couldn't spend that much money on one leather jacket but i was you know just walking around this thrift store and I was about to leave. I was going to the thrift store and I packed like four things and none of them fit me. Like five things. So devastated. So I was about to leave. Then I saw this lady and this jacket was just right behind behind her. And I wasn't really interested in jacket like at all. Like because it was brown and I was I didn't like feeling it. Then she asked, then I just asked her, hi, how much is this jacket? Because I just wanted to know. She told me 30 pounds. I was like, oh, okay, don't worry. So she called me back. Then she was like, okay, I'll give it to you for 15 pounds. And I was like, oh, okay. I tried it on, didn't feel it, but I knew I'll feel it later. And that's what happened. I got this for 15 pounds. But then at the end of the day, this is a designer, she said, designer jacket. Oh, God. In me. In me. Just know that from now on, get sick of me. Be prepared to see this jacket like five times in my videos and on Instagram. So, yeah. Second jacket I caught. What do you call this a jacket? But like, I'm in love with it. Like, this, this could be styled with the zip opened or with the zip closed. This is from the brand Compliments. I love it. I never got it. Like it's that kind of thing when you see something and you're like, I don't really want to show about you. Then I tried it on and I was in love. I was in love. Stop singing chin so we have accessories. I'm gonna begin with this bag. I just like how simple it's. I'm looking for this kind of, you know, it's just simple mini baguette bag. So what it called? I can't remember if that's what it called. I couldn't resist myself to get it. It was so pretty. And we have this tote bag. I've been looking for tote bags. And to be fair, toy bags are really expensive these days. Oh my god, what is that? You guys see that thing behind me? I just loved the color. It's It was just so... I had to get it. this tie i can't believe i almost forgot to style this tie like i was shocked my pinterest right i found so many girlies being with styling ties and they'll have like this white t-shirt button-up shirt that's not what it's called <laughs> but like 
yeah i just got this tie because i'm gonna give me school preppy vibes my style i can't really explain my style to be very honest it's a combination of everything spent almost 10 minutes remembering how to knot a tie it's gonna be part of my style from the next point of my life because yeah i love ties in my stuff right now i don't know why don't ask me why okay it's me it's just who i am right now you have to take me for who i am thank you this scarf because first of all it's cold two why not a black scarf tea and to be fair i don't really have scarves in my life so Then I have also got this bee because again it's cold and I don't own some of these things and it looks nice and it's black. Black goes with anything so yeah, that's black. Then for the most important part of this haul, I'm coming. Another reason of this whole thrift haul was finding boots and leather jackets. For the longest time I have been obsessed with boots most people don't understand why but i don't really want people to understand me so first start i'm obsessed with knee high boots and ample boots um i don't know i wear i have this black boots that i bought from pepper and co and they were 16 pound it hurt me but they're so pretty i had to get them Try them on. They were so beautiful. God. I just loved how great they fit. And they were a size 8, 42. Another thing that really got me in this whole shopping thing was I couldn't find any shoe my size. And all the pretty shoes were like size 4. I'm like, who is wearing that? Who is wearing that? I mean, no shame, but like, come on. They were four times or four, five, six. I was only lucky to see it in size seven. There was no size eight. I was like, and all the pretty ones were never my size, and they were either tight or not my size. I'm like, you guys, come on. So much to donate a size eight shoe for me, please. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Got my legs full cramped. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did. I loved talking endlessly without stopping make sure to like comment and subscribe do the needful turn on post notifications so that you can get a post notification when i post that was wrong sentences but i don't care tell me if you guys want more thrift haul thrift try on haul videos i got you guys i got you guys like i said before I'm going to be really like experimenting with my channel so you will see a thrift haul today and probably see a makeup routine tomorrow tell me video ideas you want me to do <sighs> relax relax bye